Dressing Application Guide to Bridge Two Wounds, Gauze. Thoroughly clean the wound. If required, apply a non-adherent contact layer over bone, tendon, other sensitive structures. Apply skin prep to protect the peri-wound skin. Saturate the gauze with saline provided. If filling tunneling or undermining, ensure that gauze communicates with gauze in the base of the wound. Gauze touches gauze. The gauze should fit loosely into the wound bed. Do not pack tightly or force gauze into areas of the wound. Cut the gauze to fit the size and shape of the wound. Do not cut the gauze directly over the wound. Do not allow the gauze to overlap onto intact skin. If filling a tunnel, ensure the gauze in the tunnel connects with the gauze in the wound bed. Select an area to bridge the two wounds together. Apply transparent film over any intact skin between the two wounds where the bridge will be placed. Partially peel back one side of layer one and place adhesive side down. Then remove the remaining side of layer one. Now remove the backing or layer two. Remove the perforated silver colored tab on the side. Cut a gauze bridge three centimeters wide that is about two pieces of the gauze next to each other that will be long enough to connect the two wounds together, maximum 40 centimeters long. Apply the bridge on the transparent film between the two wounds. Ensure it has good contact with the gauze in the wound and has no contact with skin that is not protected. Apply transparent film to cover all of the gauze, both wounds and bridge. Partially peel back one side of layer one and place adhesive side down. Then remove the remaining side of layer one. Now remove the backing or layer two. Remove the perforated silver colored tab on the side. The film should extend three to five centimeters beyond the margin of the gauze dressing to facilitate an adequate seal. Place the fit pad on the gauze at an appropriate location. Pinch the film, lifting slightly, and cut a small hole approximately one centimeter in diameter. Peel off the backing of the fit pad to expose the adhesive. Place the fit pad centered over the previously cut hole. Press firmly for adherence. Attach the dressing tubing to the pump tubing by pushing the quick connector together until you hear a secure click.